the truth about the Georgia Guidestone bombing and what really happened. Save this video right now. This is crazy. So right now, all local news channels are talking about this. But this is what they don't want you to know. If you guys didn't know, the Georgia Guidestones have 10 laws or lists that these higher-ups and the elites want to get done. And this list right here is 10 New World Order laws that they want to happen in the future. And just look at the first one up here. Maintain humanity under 500 million. There's 7 to 8 billion people in the world. They're trying to lower the population to be in balance with nature. And Bill Gates in his tech talk in 2010, he was already talking about this stuff. If you haven't watched his TED talk, go watch it on YouTube. I'm not putting it on here. But he was literally talking about lowering the population with this right here. It's already happening right now in the present moment. But let me talk about the news story about the Georgia Guidestones. They said someone bombed the Georgia Guidestones. But if you use Gematria, you can decipher the mainstream media by using the headlines they use. Because if you type bomb in Gematria, it equals 76. And what's today's date that the bombing happened? July 6. Oh, isn't it a coincidence that George W. Bush, the former president's birthday is today? And he turns 76. And his birthday's on July 6, 76 once again. They keep using these numbers. And if you guys didn't know, he was in a secret society in Yale called the Skull and Bones. This secret society loves using 322. If you look up the day when the Georgia Guidestones were essentially created, it was March 22nd. 322. All these numbers are not a coincidence. In the mainstream media, they love to use numbers as a code. They do this for news, sports, everything. So basically, the Georgia Guidestone bombing was a complete setup. It was 100% planned out to happen today, July 6th. And also, look up Skull and Bones on Gematria. It also equals 76. And today, as I'm recording this video, today is July 6th, when the bombing happened. It feels like we're essentially living out a script. We're playing characters in someone else's movie. That's what it feels like to me. Just be aware next time about all these news articles. And don't be afraid. Love y'all. Follow for more videos like this. You feel me? Yeah.